Yo, how's it going you sexy fuckers? My name is Neon and I'm back with another Call of Duty Vanguard video. I hope you're all having an amazing day so far, let me know in the comments down below. In today's video I'm going to be showing you a really good unlimited XP glitch working after all the recent patches in Call of Duty Vanguard. This glitch is very useful for camels and XP in the game. Also sorry for not uploading in a while everyone, I was on holiday so that's my bad. Could we go for 112 likes on this video? I know you can do it everyone, but if you don't smack that like button you will turn into this rat. Like fuck's sake, that is one ugly ass rat. But anyway, it would also be appreciated if you smacked that subscribe button on the channel as well as it helps me towards my 100,000 subscriber dream goal, so thank you very much for that. Anyways, so yeah, what I want you to do is just sit back, relax and enjoy the video. Oh shit, I forgot, here's comment of the day. If you want comment of the day, just smack a nice comment down below. Okay, a lot of people may know this already, but if you do not, make sure to go ahead and put on a double XP token. If you haven't got any, then that sucks, but the glitch will still work, obviously. You'll just get more XP if you have a double XP token, um, weapon XP tokens, whatever you have, just make sure you use them before doing this glitch. Just remember, all XP tokens transfer over from different Call of Duties, so if you have any on Cold War or Modern Warfare, activate them, come on Vanguard, and they'll be on there. So don't worry if you don't have any on Vanguard just check if you have any on other games. Then what you want to go ahead and do is pick a weapon that you've never used before or any weapon you want. Fuck's sake, I got a notification on my phone, sorry about that. Anyway, as I was saying, pick a gun that you've never used before or any gun that you want to get weapon levels on and camos, okay? Because this is very important, this glitch, this helps out a lot with camos and weapon XP. So what you want to do is go into a game of zombies and head into the theatre. You want to find the harvest theater portal okay now once you have got that and you get into the game what you want to do is fill up the first crystal with the rune stones okay as that's very important because it will change the crystal location to another spot that means the zombies will spawn in at different locations in the theater okay but once you have done all that head over to this crate right here in the theater and if you stand on the left of it all the zombies in the whole theater will go afk that means you can get all the headshots you want for your camos and stuff like that but i've got more information on it here this glitch is really good because what you can do is if you go over to the far right the zombie starts start moving again. So I'm on the right, they start moving, I head over to the left and they all start to freeze. This is basically an AFK glitch. Just be careful though, do not let the zombies freeze for too long or they will start throwing flesh at you and it will end up killing you, but it does take quite a bit of flesh for you to die, so you should be okay. All you gotta do is just keep moving left, right, left, right on this crate to get kills. So as you can see, I go over to the right for the zombies to walk towards me and then I go over to the left, they all start and still I can get my headshots for my camos, I can level up my gun and I will get XP in general. A lot of people will be wondering about the XP cap as well. It sucks that there is an XP cap in this game but this is the best we're going to get for uh, XP glitches. So what I recommend you do is start up the game, do this glitch, get around about 40 to 50 kills end the game and redo it again. What that will do is that will fix the XP cap and keep resetting it or you can do this with a friend and your friend can get into another glitch and you can keep leaving and joining back the game and getting into the glitch really quickly and you can take turns each of doing that. That is a faster method of doing it as well, it's completely up to you. But anyway, this is really good for camos, XP, weapon XP, calling cards, challenges and so much more. If you enjoyed this video it would be honestly appreciated if you smacked a like down below and subscribe to the channel. My name is Neon and I'm out. Peace.